as you got per usual, lots of stuff going on in the cosmos, lots of gravitational fields impacting our own. And now as we go into Sagittarius season, because it's the 13th, November 13th, um, still in Scorpio season, but Sag, Sag season is the middle of this month. It's really going to be time to focus on exploration and planning for the year of heads. So you might already be feeling some twinges of that energy, um, but in a good way, because again, it can bring some of that more expansive joy. Well, I hope that resonated with you, helped you made sense of, make sense of the, some things, and um, a lot was clearing off the field. The field felt like there was like a thick, almost like felt coat on it. Um, I'm going to connect in more officially with Reiki now. Here we go, and you can think or say out loud, I receive the Reiki, I receive the Reiki, I receive the Reiki, lovely. And now doing the distance symbol. Which is what I which is what I always look left at. I have the distance symbol hung up on my wall. I know people always ask that question. <sighs> Lovely connecting with you energetically through space and time. And of course, if you're not already in a comfortable place in your cozy nest, make sure to be comfortable and in a receptive space. Down at your sacral chakra, the symbol of transmutation. Also at your throat. A lot more throat stones today technically not connected to Scorpio but it's connected more to Taurus actually the throat but the sacral chakra and the throat are very intimately connected especially um, from a vocal standpoint like literally voice production if you have like pelvic issues it impacts voice production so um, on an energetic level they are also connected so I'm feeling a lot of throat chakra work tonight will be good. And still, grief in the heart, totally understandable. I'm actually going to do the star seed symbol there. There we go. Mm. Thank you.